good morning good morning good morning um welcome back to my channel guys so i'm just getting home um well i got home like a couple of days ago i was out of town for a couple of weeks visiting my in-laws i'm home now um and i came home to like my <laughs> my backyard my whole my lawn period my front and my back was looking kind of jungle ish um just two weeks of not being here and being able to maintain the grass was i came back to a freaking jungle um the back you can't my son actually cut it yesterday um so now it looks decent but my garden i can't even like it just looks like flowers in the middle of weeds i want to show it to you guys but it's raining right now so i don't know how well you're gonna be able to see it um yeah so tomorrow i wanted to de-weed today but i didn't realize that today it was gonna be raining like this like it's raining pretty bad this is what we're dealing with outside i don't know if you can tell how heavy the rain is coming down right now but it's coming down pretty heavy look at my garden look at this yeah so I need, I need to take care of that I started pulling out some weeds with my mom I'm gonna show you what we pulled out so far and I'm gonna show you what is left okay give me a second here is what we pulled out so far right these two little piles here and I'm gonna show you what is left like look at this does it not look like a little jungle Mom. Hi, sweetie. Hi, baby. What's up? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Like, look at this. Helping your mom uh, reap the weed. <laughs> Not good ones. And because my mom is so awesome, good she weeds. decides to come over here and <laughs> help me de weed. Whatever. Right, mom? Because you just love me so much. Whatever. But I think my mom just loves to see a good, a nice looking garden. She doesn't want yes, to see it look like trash. So yes, here she is. This is what my garden is looking like right now. But um, I will come back and show you guys what it looks like, the aftermath. Okay, so here's what we've taken out. You can see this is what the garden line is looking like so far. There's still more weeds to go, but honestly, tomorrow's another day. <laughs> I'm already done. Just from what we did. So my rose bush. I feel like it did bud some, but um, I don't know if it's because it was like covered with a lot of weeds. I don't know. My mom said it should. It, this one should bud twice for the year too, mom. Maybe. Yeah. Should. Yeah, but this is what it looks like. But there's too many mosquitoes and stuff out here. Like I'm getting bit like crazy. But we got a lot done. You can actually see the definition and see where like the garden starts and the lawn ends so that's a plus but yeah as you can see there's still like weeds here that need to come out around my hosta but yeah too many bugs too many mosquitoes and yeah we're about to do some driving lessons I don't know if I ever told you guys that I'm an, like, an amazing, amazing driver. I taught my son how to drive, my oldest son, and now it is time to teach my baby boy how to drive. <laughs> um, so we're about to just go around in the parking lot and let's see what he can do. And then we'll go from there. Good? All right, let's do this. You check your mirrors and everything. Make sure everything is adjusted to how you need it so that it's easy for you to see everything. You can see the back through the back window. All right? Okay, so you're gonna put your foot on the brake. Remember, when you, that's not the brake. So. <laughs>
too bad. A little bit off the line, but you know, still in the line, which is good. We just got back from taking my son driving so he got to get some practice in i'm liking the way this light is hitting and i'm about to take this hair out like i'm i'm over it now i need i like i need to wash my hair Ugh, i i'm i'm over it i've had it in much longer than i would have liked to have it in so it's time to go. Like, I can't even get this clip out of my bloody head. Like, it's time to get this out. So I'm gonna go listen to a sermon that my god sister sent me and work on taking these twists out of my head. I've had them in now for like over a month. Like, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It's it's more than time. Oh, my head, like now it's just getting annoying. Like I just need them gone. I need them gone. Okay, can I get this microphone? Like seriously. Oh, holy shiznit. Why are you being so difficult? Right, mama? Oh my gosh oh okay yeah so it's time to get these gone i'm actually excited i'm missing my hair now yeah it's time it's time honey to get these out wash my hair give my hair a nice treatment Alrighty, i'm gonna go take these out of my head Brooklyn, leave it. Leave it. Leave it, please. Thank you. Yes, son. Yes, Julio. Yes, Julio. Mom. Go. I'm recording. Stop doing that. Are you recording? Yeah. This is my son, guys. This is what YouTubers be doing. <laughs> the same one who complains about me having his location. You hear how he's calling me? Mama! Mama! Mm -hmm. What were you thinking? What, what are the options? I don't know. I was probably just gonna go wear the dark, the dark blue jeans with the gray sweater and the red fitted and call it a day. But I don't know. Which one? Say that again. The dark what? The dark, the dark blue jeans that you bought me mm -hmm. with the gray, the gray Nike sweater and then the red fitted and call it a day. That could work. Girl, get down. Like, do not sit. Stand in the chair, please. Is this supposed to be here? What? The hair? Yeah, I just left it there. I was going to sit over there and do it, but then I decided to come over on this side. 
Are you saying you done found the love of your life? Verse I wish. What are you talking about? No. I'm like he did. He found the love of your life. Did? I'm gonna say my love of my life is gone. My love of my life is getting married to another man. No. Why are you rolling your eyes at me? I'm trying to watch my sermon in peace. The Great Commission. You should ask your, you should ask your YouTube subscribers if that's trifling. It's not trifling. I don't need to ask anybody anything. You are the one that ends the relationship. real disloyal on her part. You ended the relationship. I feel like legit. So she's supposed to sit and wait for you. 100%. At least give me like a year. No. She's yeah, young. Why would she sit and wait for you? I feel like that's real trifling on her part. I'm not going to lie. No. Okay, Biohazard. Biohazard is crazy. I have no. I got to rewind this because everybody's talking to me at once. I don't even know what Pastor... Sarah Jakes is even talking about Sarah Jakes Roberts. Don't you want to look fresh? You all tonight that you haven't called anybody to make any appointments. Chris. Don't roll your eyes. that story time. Once upon a time, I was seven years old. Okay. And my mom thought it was a good idea to try to line me up like she's a barber or something and gave me a real bald spot in the middle of my head. And I have to live like that for the rest of my life. It, was meant, it wasn't meant to be there because if it was, it would have grew, grew back a long time. What are you talking about? It wasn't meant to be cut off my hair. No, who's the clippers? Better light so you can see what's going but see? on. No. <sighs> but see now, you can't even tell. Cause the barber did its thing. Get off of me, mother! Me. Okay, you stop. You know you're heavy. Yeah, that's a nail clip. Okay, get off me. You, how much do you weigh? Like two hundred pounds? Get off of me. You know, any of you subscribers that want to hit up my line. Get off Messing. me. Nobody don't care about you. Get up. <laughs> All the single mothers looking for love. That's what we Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. <laughs> about single mothers looking for love. You see what I got to deal with? Goodness. What I wanted to say is show you guys how much my hair has actually grown. Like... Uh, look at length. I go through after I finish getting all of them out. I'll go ahead and like separate them. But come on here, come through her. Because I had my hair for so long, it's been hot, sweaty, all that other crap. 
um, my roots started to lock like if I was about to dread my hair. So I had to go through it like in small little sections well, by each twist. I went through each twist individually and had to like, you know, gently separate and then like go through it so that I didn't and try not to rip out my hair. But this is what my hair looks like. I'm going to wash it and twist it up. 